Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Alex Linker. And I'm Darren Francis. Today is Thursday, May 18th, and we are here with your morning announcements. Reminder to all students to return books and other items to the library to clean your account since summer is nearing. If you have any questions, look in this week's Wolfpack newsletter for more information. Now let's go see Damon and Angelina for your In the News update. Hey there, Wolfpack. I'm Damon Ramos. And I'm Angelina Doherty, and this is your In the News Update. Montana has become the first state to ban TikTok. Governor Greg Gianforte signed Senate Bill 419 on Wednesday, saying he wants to protect the state's residents' private information from being compromised. It is expected for TikTok to challenge the bill in federal court, but the ban is set to take effect January 1, 2024. An eight-year-old girl died after being detained by Border Patrol agents in Texas. She passed following a quote-unquote medical emergency while being detained with her family yesterday. Emergency services were called and the child was transported to a hospital where she was pronounced dead. Her death is currently being investigated by the Office of Professional Responsibility. This story is still developing. On Thursday, there is a Supreme Court ruling involving Google and Twitter. Accusers Tomne and Gonzalez sued Google and Twitter for assisting in terrorism because they didn't take down any social media accounts or posts by ISIS terrorists on their platforms. The court ruled for Twitter and Google with their reasoning being that they are protected by Section 230, which protects the freedom of speech of users online and the services used. Well, that's all the news that we have for you for forever. I'm Damon Ramos. And I'm Angelina Doherty. Thank you for tuning in. Back, Back to, to the, the Anchors. anchors. Wow, thanks guys. Seniors, don't forget to sign up for Senior Sober Grad Night May 24th from 10 p.m. to 4.30 a.m. at Country Club Lanes. Activities will include laser tag, bowling, arcade games, billiards, food and drinks, and more. Tickets are $90 and can be purchased via the Wolfpack newsletter now. Our graduation ceremony is coming up next Wednesday, May 24th. Please review this week's newsletter regarding EGUSD graduation ceremonies. It is recommended students do not wear high heels. Additionally, you should not bring large bags of any kind as they won't be allowed inside. And finally, no balloons, noisemakers, or large signs will be allowed either. Now let's check out this year's VAPA Gala. Thank you for a fantastic year and leading with kindness, grace, and a voice that makes me want to hear the state run again and again. <laughs> guys are so cutie. <laughs> Seniors, remember that you have to return your Chromebooks during textbook returns. When returning them, please include your Chromebook charger and make sure that it's clean and you remove any personal stickers. Finally, don't forget Senior Awards Night nice tonight and Senior Barbecue and Sunset are Friday. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Darren Francis, and as always, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And I'm Alex Linker, and the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National I Love Reese's, Reese's Day, Day Wolfpack. Wolfpack.